In the previous video, we learned that weather is the condition of the atmosphere in an area at a specific time. Climate, on the other hand, deals with a set of weather conditions for a long period in a region. In this lesson, we will discuss the different weather systems. Specifically, we will describe how these weather systems are formed. But what are these weather systems? Air pressure, air masses, fronts, thunderstorms, tornadoes, and cyclones are examples of weather systems. Air pressure or atmospheric pressure is a force exerted or a pressure on the Earth's surface. Differences in air pressure in different areas are due to unequal heating of the surface. These uneven heating and heat redistribution processes are the causes of what we perceive as weather. The vertical heat transport is what causes vertical air current which in turn becomes clouds and thunderstorms. The horizontal heat transport causes differences in temperature in tropical areas and higher latitude areas which in turn produces air pressure differences. Air pressure is determined by the extent and temperature of the air mass. But what's air mass? Air mass is a large region of the atmosphere which share the similar characteristics of its given area. Air masses originating from sea or ocean are called the maritime air masses. These air masses are characterized as moist. Air masses coming from land are relatively dry and are called continental air masses. The main properties of air masses are air temperature and moisture. Warm air which rises creates low pressure area. Cold air which sinks creates high pressure area. The difference in pressure makes air move from high to low pressure areas which then creates wind. When the two air masses meet, a front is formed. Fronts bring clouds and precipitation over an area with accompanying temperature, moisture, pressure, and wind changes. A cold front occurs when cold air mass replaces a warm air mass. The warm front occurs in reverse of the occurrence of the cold front. Weather systems can be observed in a relatively small area. A thunderstorm is an example of a weather system where lightning and thunder are produced. It is formed when warm air moves upward to an altitude of about 15 kilometers. It is accompanied by strong winds and heavy rain. When the sky darkens, cumulonimbus clouds are formed that signals the formation of thunderstorms. Lightning is a result of a friction between the electrical charges created by the rise and fall of air. It happens inside the clouds or between clouds or the ground. As lightning strikes, the surrounding air heats up producing a loud sound known as thunder. Associated with thunderstorms are tornadoes. Tornadoes, or locally known as Ipo-Ipo or Buhawi, are narrow and funnel-shaped spirals of wind which rotate rapidly. The rotation speeds up to 500 km per hour due to extreme difference in the pressure. The Fujita Intensity Scale categorizes tornadoes as weak, strong, and violent. The basis for the scale are wind speed and degree of destruction. A cyclone is a large and violent whirlwind observed in different parts of the Earth. Tropical areas such as the Philippines use the term tropical cyclones. Cyclone brings violent winds and thunderstorms to the affected areas. They move in a spiral motion where in the center is called the eye of the storm. In the next lesson, we will discuss the different weather systems that is specific in the Philippines. Make sure to subscribe to this channel for more science videos. Thank you and always remember that you are all awesome.